In this video tutorial, I will be showing you how to zoom in on your video so video tutorial so people can you know actually see what you're talking about cuz sometimes when I've go on YouTube and people make like the video tutorials are like great it's really brilliant but the video quality is actually really horrible and you know it's all blurry I can't even see what they're doing I don't even know if they're actually moving around but I can see the colors change like blur change anyways this is for people who are lazy either that or they don't know that or for people that doesn't know how to zoom in on your computer because some people who have Camtasia they're too lazy to do the zoom and panning op uh, the zoom and panning editing thing in the studio so they just upload that whole that um, full screen recording and it turns out really horrible no offense but it does okay I'm going to show you the first option isn't the best option but you go to start control panel go to accessibility options and click on the magnifier alright what the magnifier allows you to do is this isn't, isn't the best way yet but you don't have to download anything through this it allows you to let your viewer see what what you're doing on your computer zoomed up so you can see on the top yeah they can actually see what you're doing um, it's kind of like a auto pan option I guess but not really auto pan is way better way 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 better yeah you can do this and that and I wouldn't recommend it but you know there are other options so there are, you can assess whatever you want pick your options whatever I'm sorry I can't talk today it's okay alright another way is do a program called zoom it zoom it will be in the dis video description so check that out it doesn't even waste that much memory on your computer yeah so zoom in I recommend this highly recommend it alright um, just download load up zoom it it should look like this um, you can do you can even draw with this program and so on but I use it mainly for zooming alright so I'm gonna zoom right on my desktop by clicking control one so you can see it zoomed in and now it's kind of like kind of like auto um, auto pan except with your whole whole desktop you can zoom in a little f further I guess or is that the max okay that is the max anyways you can also use your scrolly bar oh why can't I use it it worked fine earlier Okay, I can't use it. I don't know why. Wait, let me try this out. Doo -doo. Oh, what's happening? Okay, now I can zoom with the scrolly bar only when I'm drawing. That sucks. Alright, you can, if you want your cursor to go back instead of drawing just click the escape button like when you zoom in you can draw yeah so that's pretty nice and you can also um, select your color by clicking like R for red B for blue O for orange P for pink G for green so on yeah so very simply that's how you use the zoom it tool even though I don't you know really color that much on my desktop alright another one another another option is through using a recorder called the BSR screen recorder it's absolutely free that's the best part it's absolutely free and it's pretty nice screen recorder 
but I don't know what's with the what's with the audio. The audio audio is horrible for me. Uh, I'm a picky person, so you guys might not think it's that horrible, but I don't like it as much as Camtasia. Why use the old when you can use the new? I actually started off using BSR as my first few video tutorials, and later on I found found Camtasia Studio, so I deleted like the BSR screen recorder and used Camtasia Studio. I actually used, started I think using the 2.0 when I last used it. Now I think it upgraded to 4.0. All right, so check me out with the BSR screen recorder in a few more seconds. Few more seconds. All right, so I'm on the BSR screen recorder, and I hope my cursor is not deformed like the first take. And if it is, I'm sorry. Anyways, it includes quite a lot of options, um, like it also includes the watermark for you, uh, captions timestamps, a studio, a lab, though I'm not very fond of those because I don't even know how to use them because it looks pretty confusing. Yeah, with that, and you can zoom in and out using the F9 and the F10 key. The F9 is to zoom in, if you can see, the F10 is to zoom out. Yeah, so it's very convenient because like you're zooming in and out during your take so I find it pretty nice um I don't know why but the the audio on this doesn't sound as clear as when I record in Camtasia studio but it's free come on I wouldn't ask too much for it but I'm not sure because there there's an option to um, but purchase the full version so I'm pretty sure that this is like not the full version and um, really um, I don't think there's a trial though and you just have to learn to ignore the little BSR watermark down here um, you just have to learn to ignore that but you can also add your own watermark so that's pretty nice um yeah so Really, that's the end of this video tutorial. Just um, check out BSR Screen Recorder because I, I think it's pretty nice, pretty nice, pretty nice program. Um, and I'm sorry for being repetitive because I don't have anything else to say. So yeah, that's the end of this video tutorial. Please rate, please comment, and please, please, please subscribe to my videos if you like them. It would help me a lot. Um, Alright, thank you guys for checking out this video and remember to look in the descriptions for download links and more information. Alright.